If a man asks these seven questions from you, he is obviously interested in you. Have you ever wondered if the nice guy in your life is truly smitten with you, or if he's simply being nice? I mean, it can be difficult to figure out. However, there are some indicators that may reveal his true intentions. The best clue of all? The questions he asks. Obviously, not every question signals a guy is smitten. It's only normal for us to ask questions during a conversation. However, there are several questions that when asked could suggest a more intense interest. In this video, we'll discuss some common questions a guy might ask when he is smitten with you. Ready to find out? Without further ado, let's get started. Here are seven questions guys usually ask that are typical indicators that a guy is interested in you. Number one, they'll start by asking for your name. This is something obvious. It's an excellent opening question that people who are interested in you will all lead with. It's also one way they can introduce themselves to you and learn your name. A guy will approach you and say hello, introduce himself, and then ask for your name. I know you're curious about why so many men use this technique, but you'll find out soon enough. Guys who are interested in you will want to initiate a conversation with you. When you start talking to them, they'll have the opportunity to continue talking with you and ask you any additional questions that you'll find later in this video. If you don't answer the first question, the communication between you two will end. When a man approaches you and says hello, but you ignore him, he assumes you aren't interested in talking with him. He'll simply walk away from you in order to locate someone else prepared to engage in discussion with him. Guys will ask, what is your name? Who may I call you? Can I know the name of the gorgeous woman I'm talking to? What is the name of the beautiful lady driving my focus to the edge? These are the types of questions that men who are interested in you will ask you. The way they will ask this question is to make you feel good about yourself and compliment you. This is the first part that will always keep the conversation going so they may delve deeper into other areas. Some will start with a brief discussion about your name, what it means, and how it reflects you as a person in order to get your attention. Number two, they will want to know about your hobbies. Guys who are interested in you will ask about your hobbies. They will want to know what you're interested in doing. These types of questions may seem obvious to you because you're used to discussing what you enjoy doing in your spare time, but this is a gold mine for men who are interested in you. They can learn a lot about you if they know what you're interested in. The things you enjoy doing define you as a person. They'll know if you're smart or dumb based on the responses you give them. A man may have noticed you from a distance and thought you were gorgeous simply by the way you looked. Some guys will go even further and ask what you do to get a better sense of who you are as a person. These are a few examples of questions men who are interested in you will ask when they want to know what you like doing. What do you like doing during your free time? If we spend an entire day together, what would you choose to do? Is there anything particular that you like spending your time on? I enjoy seeing the world just exploring. Do you like it too? These are the types of questions men will ask when they want to know what you like to do in your leisure time. Your answers to these questions will determine whether they continue to pull you closer or walk away from you. What you enjoy doing will also give these guys an indication of whether or not they can connect with you. If you prefer doing the opposite of what they enjoy, they will decide that you are not the person they want to talk with. Some guys will end the conversation with an excuse to walk away from you, whereas others will just tell you how they feel about what you do for fun. When you enjoy the same activities, you're more likely to connect with each other. Number three, they will ask if you want to hang out with them. If a guy is interested in you, he will ask if you have time to hang out with him. When they're interested in you, all the guys will want to spend time with you. They need to be near you in order to make their move on you. Every guy takes a different strategy when it comes to asking whether you have time to hang out with them. Before they get to this point, they should have asked you what you enjoy doing in your spare time. You told me you like surfing, but you are better at it. On Monday, can I be your coach? Would you have dinner with me? Maybe some dancing after. I would love to teach you how to dance. I got some sick moves. Can we meet up later this evening so I can show you how to do it? You enjoy cycling, right? Why don't we get together this Saturday and cycle around? All of these questions have one thing in common. 
This guy wants to get together and spend time with you. He wants to spend some time with you, not teach you how to dance. This guy is attracted to you. Some guys interested in you will approach you directly to know whether you want to hang out with them. I like you and I'd love to get to know you better. Would you like to go on a date this Friday? Can we meet up this weekend for a cup of coffee? Can this gorgeous woman offer me a date at least? These are the questions that men who are interested in you will ask you. They'll want to spend time with you just to get to know you better. Furthermore, when you choose to spend time with them, they will try to convey their feelings about you. Some will directly tell you why they wanted to meet you and hang out, while others will simply have fun with you, make you feel at ease with them, and play the long game. Number four, do you have a boyfriend? Guys who ask this question are usually looking to see if there's potential for a romantic connection. This question can frequently appear direct, yet it shows a person's effort to avoid stepping on anyone's toes or approaching someone who is unavailable. They're essentially trying to grasp the landscape. Is someone already in the picture, or is there a chance they'll be a part of your life? Number five, what's your favorite food? When a guy asks about your food preferences, he may be thinking about places to take you out or meals to share. It's a kind gesture, signaling that he wants to learn more about you, right down to your palate preferences. Beyond the romance of meals, understanding a person's culinary preferences can reveal a lot about them, their cultural background, their adventures with various cuisines, or simply their fondness for simple homemade dinners. Number six, what are your thoughts about marriage? This is a tricky yet crucial question. If he's asking this question after only one or two dates, he's clearly interested in you. This suggests he is thinking about the future and about marrying you. He wants to know what your thoughts are on marriage and relationships. And number seven, what do you like about me? If he asks this question, he is most likely curious about what makes him unique and whether you're interested in him. It's also an excellent conversation starter. If a guy is interested in you, he looks for every means to initiate a conversation. So if he asks this question, don't be hesitant to tell him what you admire about him. Make sure you tell him the truth in detail. He might not want to hear, I admire your courage and strong will. It would give them the impression that you were simply being polite. Instead, tell him what you enjoy about his personality. Is he funny, kind, smart, attractive? Tell him those things. Well, there you have it. Hope it was interesting, and thanks for watching.